Hi, I wanted to do a super simple video or DIY that I did to create a doggy perfume for our dog. We call him Diplo Dog on Instagram, but at home he is Pompey to us and our very first fur baby. So I was doing research and the first video that comes up has someone putting alcohol in a plastic bottle which I don't think is very healthy because after a while well alcohol is actually poisonous to dogs and humans so I would avoid it. I was exploring using witch hazel but then again when I searched some more there was a Young Living video that showed that you can just do it with just plain water no alcohol or witch hazel necessary. However, I also made sure to research on what scents were not great for dogs or that are toxic to dogs. So I would avoid peppermint and eucalyptus uh, and I decided to really simplify it. My favorite scent is calming green tea and of course it's not good for the dog to ingest it. I only spray this perfume to the body of the dog away from the nose Actually, doggy perfume is really more for humans, not for dogs. Dogs are very sensitive to it. So, I also made it even more um, diluted. Instead of just using one cup of water, I used one and a half cups of water. Just distilled purified water. You can use whatever um, you like, just make sure that it is not toxic to dogs. And then I gave it a good shake and you know what? It's very subtle but I love it and I don't want to make my dog uncomfortable. So this is perfect for us and at least I know there are no nasty chemicals in the spray. Always make sure to check what essential oils are toxic for your dogs before making your own perfume. And of course, I think we only spray maybe two or three times a week. I wouldn't do it every day because, you know, dogs are very sensitive. Their sense of smell is so sensitive. So it's really just for us. So I hope you enjoyed this video.